I'm Maki Gotsuda. Tokyo International Airport, which many of you may know as Haneda Airport, is a key airport of the Tokyo metropolitan area and the biggest in Japan. Now, this time we'll be bringing you the show from Haneda Airport Garden, which opened just this past January and is directly connected to Terminal 3. I'm at Haneda Airport Garden and with me to show us around is Mariko Fukaya. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I know that Haneda Airport Garden just opened. What kind of facility is it? It's centered on two airport hotels and we have a natural hot spring bath as well as a shopping area. Our facility also has an all-weather bus terminal. It's divided into several different sections. This is called Haneda Sando and it's a street with all kinds of shops selling gifts and souvenirs and local specialties from across Japan. Further on is Haneda Collection, where you can find shops selling travel-focused products to take and use on your journey. This place is called Haneda Sando. Sando is a traditional street leading to a shrine with shops on both sides, and the design is modeled on Torii Shrine Gates. Torii Gates. Makiko spots an interesting shop. These are very beautiful. I've never seen them before. These are Japanese sake bottles with koi carb designs. This is called kohaku and this is tancho. Our shop is called Yamakoshi Honpo and we mainly sell products from Yamakoshi and Niigata Prefecture. Yamakoshi is also the birthplace of these koi carbs, and that's why we have bottles with these designs. I see all kinds of sake. Yes, we mainly carry sake from breweries in Niigata Prefecture's Nagaoka City, and many of them are hard to find in Tokyo. With the small bottles, you can compare the tastes of each, and these are four types which you can try according to the season. The labels are lovely. They all depict the seasons of Nagaoka. In addition to sake, we also sell rice. Yamakoshi in Niigata is a very snowy region, and the rice is made using spring water from melted snow. These? Yes. It has a very sweet taste and a chewy texture. It's really tasty. We also have sweet sake made from that very delicious rice, as well as miso and rice crackers. This pound cake is made not from wheat but rice flour and is gluten-free. Are they popular as gifts? Yes, many people come here to buy our rice products. Next, Makiko visits a shop along Haneda Sando that mainly sells chopsticks. There's a colorful variety on display. Who are your main customers? I would have to say we get many customers from overseas now. Europe, America and Asia, people from all over. And if you can wait for about 10 to 20 minutes, we can even engrave your chopsticks. Right here? Yes. Thank you for waiting. It's ready? Yes. Oh, I'm so excited. Wow, my name is properly engraved. Thank you. So, here's my name engraved in gold letters. I really like it. It's a one and only pair of chopsticks just for me. After exploring the Haneda collection area, Makiko heads to 
This is called Koki Your Doors, and the shop is right next to Haneda Collection. It's run by major Japanese stationery maker Kokio. This is among the most popular shops in our facility among overseas visitors. What's the concept behind this shop? Haneda Airport is the gateway into Japan for people from abroad, and we want them to try out and learn about Japanese stationery. How many products do you have here? We have about 700 types of items. What are some of the more popular products or genres? Japanese writing stationery is highly functional and relatively inexpensive, so we have a very good reputation among people from overseas. I'm especially curious about this. What is it? Actually, well, this is the first stationary IoT vending machine in Japan. And you can buy selected sets of really popular Kokuyo products, as well as slightly unusual and unique goods. How's the response from customers? Very good. For many people, it's the first time to buy stationery from a vending machine, so they seem to have a lot of fun. This must be Japan Promenade leading into Haneda Airport. Yes, exactly. This area has shops selling traditional Japanese products. Makiko notices a shop selling umbrellas. I see some umbrellas with very unique designs that I've never seen before. The handle is made of bamboo and it's lacquered. We also make this type, which has ribs covered in a textile called tsumugi or ponji. Isn't it the textile used for kimono? Yes. It won't break a year or five years or 10 or 15 years after you buy it. You'll be able to use it for even longer than that. Our concept is umbrellas that you can use for a long time, a very long time. Fukui Prefecture is a production region for habutai silk textiles. And these umbrellas have a similar texture to silk. If you open it up, there are 24 ribs, and it's called janome, or bullseye umbrella. If you have it open like this, the rain falling on it makes a very beautiful sound. It's designed even to make it sound good. Yes. While enjoying the sound of the rain, you drop it down a notch, and this size makes it a janome umbrella. This time we brought you the show from Haneda Airport Garden, a big multi-purpose complex directly connected to the airport. We hope you enjoyed it.